The conduction of an electrical signal in the nervous system allows muscles to contract and relax. During surgical procedures, we need the muscles to remain relaxed. Let's see how we do this. The nervous system is a group of neurons with gaps in between. Electrical signals pass between these gaps from one neuron to the next with the help of neurotransmitters. This is the neurotransmitter, acetylcholine. When acetylcholine binds to the receptor, it opens the receptor and allows sodium to enter. This is sodium. When sodium enters the neuron, its ionic charge allows the electrical signal to move from the last neuron to the next neuron. With acetylcholine bound to the receptor, the electrical signal fires until it reaches the muscle. Depolarizing neuromuscular blockers will bind to the acetylcholine receptor and activate it, keeping it open. The drug will continuously activate the acetylcholine receptor and allow sodium to enter. Acetylcholine is metabolized by the enzyme acetylcholinesterase. With the continuous activation of the acetylcholine receptor by the drug, the electrical signal continues to fire and causes initial muscular contraction. The binding of depolarizing neuromuscular blockers keep the receptor open for so long that it becomes desensitized to acetylcholine. The desensitized receptor stops the electrical signal and the muscles remain relaxed.